the Oregon State Beavers after an eight-day layoff. Their first game since achieving their highest ranking in school history, number four in the AP poll, and they dominate Utah State 75-46. Those are some good numbers, Roz. Absolutely. What you're seeing is a dynamic veteran backcourt and then the young freshman center there in Taylor Jones. But let's start with the vets and the backcourt in Michaela Pivik, who did a little bit of everything, almost had a triple-double tonight, showing the dribbling, the ability to create for her teammates right there, the body control and strength to finish over the defense. She sets the tone. And then her backcourt mate there, that's Destiny Slocum, who put the team put them in a spin cycle with her dribbling ability. That was what? the Slocum Slalom right oh, there. Oh, my bad, Slocum Slalom. Yeah. You've copyrighted that because <laughs> that's what she does. She's able to create her own shot, but tonight she did a great job of creating for her teammates. And speaking of teammates that got created for, Taylor Jones. There was a nice connection for Pivik to Jones on this lob. And as a freshman, she's got a real good understanding of uh, positioning and sealing and creating the angle. And she's very nice around the rim. It's, it's all of these pieces come together to make them very dangerous. That trio combined for 49 points. Destiny Slocum is Oregon State's destiny. The final four, they get another win. They're 9-0.